Chinese hacker who breached Microsoft email platform this year have also managed to steal tens of thousands of emails from U.S. State Department accounts. A huge security risk emerges from the Intel breach. The U.S. State Department staffer who attended a briefing by state IT department said at least 60,000 emails were stolen from at least 10 State Department accounts. Nine of the victims were working on East Asia, the Pacific, and one on Europe. U.S. officials and Microsoft said in July those Chinese state-linked hackers had accessed email accounts at around 25 organizations since May, including the U.S. Commerce and State Department. Further, the State Department individual whose accounts were compromised mostly focused on Indo-Pacific diplomacy efforts. The hackers also obtained a list containing all of the department's emails. However, the extent of the compromised classified information remains unclear. The United States allegations that China was behind the breach, has strained an already tense relationship between the two countries. Beijing has denied the charges. The sweeping hack has refocused attention on Microsoft's outside role in providing IT services to the U.S. government. The State Department has begun moving to, quote, hybrid environments to multiple vendor companies and has also improved uptake of multi-factor authentication as part of measures to protect its system.